Who am I? Well, there's a Chad before real estate. In the 1990s, I enjoyed always being an entrepreneur. I had a national account management position and then a vice president of operations position for a national company, running call centers, writing scripts, and maintaining sales. And then in the 2000s, I met Renee Aguiar, who is the re of reach. I'm the ch. So Renee had a portfolio expansively throughout Miami, commercial on South Beach, multifamily up the Biscayne Corridor, luxury homes in Miami Beach, historic homes in the Miami Shores area, and there was a whole world of real estate happening from an investment side of things. So with my background of national account management and business running, I took over the restorations, the tenants, the accounting, the marketing of those portfolio items. And then in the 2010, we started having children, two sets of twins. So we liquidated everything so that we can roll on the grass and look at animals in the clouds. So then life in our real estate store opened because we felt that after dealing with all of our portfolio with financial advisors, portfolio managers, and lawyers for everything that we conduct, we knew the importance of that role in a real estate business. In 2017, we opened our real estate store in the Publix Plaza in Loxahatchee, the acreage in Palm Beach in the Northwest Corridor. This is Renee and myself with our children in 2017, where that was our grand opening. We had a children's room because everything is surrounded with our family. Every step forward in business is a step back to our family. We opened Reach Estate Realty Group, and that was a fruition of desiring to serve based on the way that we had desired to be served. This was our store opening, a very humble open office of kind of a, uh, a coffee shop atmosphere where you can come in and sit on our couch and have conversations to share your life. A month after opening, Sherry called me and said, I've got to be part of that operation. She was a 20-year resident of Loxahatchee, and then we flourished into a local community of real estate agents. So everything was very localized and intimate. We found EXP in 2019, which then brought us into Reach Estate Team versus Reach Estate Realty, and the EXP model saved our business. We were able to expand much more into the community, but then beyond. We made relationships with leadership from Boca to Orlando and even north. As we continued going forward in having our business there for three years, we would seek the guidance of those wise ones that also surrounded us that were within the EXP organization. But then the cruise that we went on with Gene Frederick, I sat on the front deck with him and I asked him, how should we move forward in our business? He said, embrace the model and close your office, which is what we did. We then invested in the intersection lot, which was a residential lot across the intersection of our Publix Plaza. We then had the desire to build a building across the street and have the office there, but again, per Gene Frederick's advice, to sell everything and embrace the virtual model, we did so. So we successfully changed that zoning, we sold that prop at a very profitable rate, and expanded our business throughout Florida. This is just a wonderful reflection of the community of emerging agents that our organization began to serve in the virtual world of EXP. We now offer a membership-only page within a library that is based on the most popular topics of agents' questions, and we have enjoyed being involved in over 700 transactions of our emerging agents, totaling $300 million. I'm always looking to find my way back home and I'm always wanting the same for the agents that we serve, that you have the opportunity to leverage your world around you so then you can be at home around your family table and always being present emotionally and mentally so you're a happy agent and then therefore you're a successful business person. I look forward to just continuing to get to know you. Always feel free to reach out to me. I'm Chad Hanna. Thanks for listening.